So the plan for today, once I find a couple of schools of redfin, I'll mark them up and then I'm going to throw out the soft plastics. We'll see what we can pick up. Yes. Oh, he's got a mate with him. <laughs> His mate's sitting there swimming around with him. There he is. Just gone. Everyone think he wanted that lure as well. There we go. There you go, it's another nice little ready. See if we can get his mate. Yes. A little one though, I think. Ah, oh, he dropped it again. Yes. Dropped it and picked him back up. Giddy. Yes, another nice little red fin. All right, so we've just gone over a massive school of fish. There we go. And I knew I would hook up there. Feels like a good fish too. Another nice little fish. Good beauty. Yes, there we go. Nice fish, that one. All right. All right. There you go, guys. They're all around the same size at the moment. Um. There you go. Yeah. In between 25 and 30 centimeters and that was taken on the southern edge lures uh soft plastic um and that's the red fin there and he just couldn't resist it added a little bit of aniseed scent to it as well and bob's your uncle red fin for dinner you beauty let's get the lure back out and see if i can pick up another one in quick succession So the jig head I'm using is a one, I think it's a one-tenth of an ounce, uh, the Nedlock jig head. All right. Fish on. Don't go under there. Oh yeah, crack a fish, this one. This is the fish we came here for. Come on. Don't go under there. Oh yes! That is the fish that we came here for. Oh yeah. Fish on here too. Yes. Oh. All right. This feels like an all right fish too. Can we have two from the same school? All we're doing, I'm just letting the wind drift me. I'm drifting with the wind. And sure enough, the plastics are bouncing across the bottom and we're picking up fish. All right, yeah, now we've got a problem. Where is he? Where is he? Come on. Oh yeah, thumper fish. Yes. All right. Problem we've got. All right. You can go there. Yeah. Oh, he wasn't getting off. Yes. Two thumpers. 
Hey, Petey. Uh, all right. There you go, guys. There's the first one. Caught on the calico candy. And here's the second one. I would show you what he was caught with, but he's inhaled that lure and you can't see it. Alrighty. Look at that. Pigeon pair of redfin. Ugh. Yeah, beauty. That's a better size that we that's a better size that we're looking for. Absolute cracking fish. Ripper. I don't think the camera can pick this up or not. This is how bad this guy has engulfed that lure. If you look down his gullet, the lure's halfway down his stomach. I think he was hungry. Alright. And there's the lure that's doing the damage. Really good fish, this one. Staying deep, that's always good. Means it's decent size. Jeez, doesn't want to come up yet. Oh yeah, look at the size of that one. That's a good fish. Where is he? Yes, that is a fish and a half, that one. That's the one we come here for. Look at the size of that. Yes. Yes. Oh yeah. Look at that in the net, you bloody ripper. That is a cracker fish. That is a thumping fish, that one. Let him get the measuring device out. Let's see how big she goes. Absolute beast of a redfin. That's made my day, that has. It's actually made my week. My week's been pretty crap, actually. Alrighty. Fish on. Again, on the soft plastic. Hard bodies are just not doing it at the moment for some reason. Not sure why. Oh, yeah, nice fish. Uh, yes. Absolutely engulfed that soft plastic. Uh, All right. There you go, guys. Another average size redfin from today's session. Taken on the... Taken on the little smelt pattern, smelt pattern soft plastic. Uh, that's another one of the Southern Edge lures soft plastics. The redfin can't resist. That's in the natural pattern. I've been getting them on the calico candy, uh, so I thought I'd change it up a bit. I'm going to start going for trout pretty soon, so I thought I'd throw one of them on and see what happened. Sure enough, this guy couldn't resist. He 
a beauty. Oh, it bang. Fish on. I don't want to pull too tight on this fish because the last couple I've done it with, I've pulled the hooks. Feels like an alright fish too. Only using four pound line on this rod and four pound leader not a lot of structure out here for you to get snapped off on so i'm running a really light drag oh yeah good fish probably the biggest fish of the day as long as i can keep him attached yes Beauty. Uh, look at that. And the lures just popped out while he was sitting in the net. So what I'm gonna do is cast that back out there. There we go guys. He'd go probably 30 odd. Beauty. Two good fillets off him. Sweet. Alright, so we've got another inquiry on this one. Yes, fish on. This feels like a good fish as well. And you can see how easy it is. All I'm doing, as I've said, just letting the wind take me wherever it wants to take me. And sure enough, the kayak's doing its job making these plastics work across the bottom oh yeah another crack of fish oh yeah hey all right oh geez line everywhere all right. there you go guys another crack of little redfin and these soft plastics from Southern Edge Lures are absolutely dynamite down here at the moment. They're working an absolute treat. Alrighty, another fish, beauty. Swimming towards me, which is a good thing. Is he as good as first thought? No, he's alright. If he gets off, I'm not fast. Alright. Alright. Oh, and the little's just popped out. guys another nice little red fin beauty i'm gonna let him go i've got enough in there and i'm gonna be out here again tomorrow morning so hopefully the big one sharp tomorrow morning we can take home a feed of red fin for logan gone so of course as every fisherman knows as i'm slowly heading back to the boat ramp which is over there i thought i'd have one more cast Sure enough, picked up another one. Again, I'm not going to keep any more. I've got enough there. There you go, guys. The Calico Candy. Southern Edge Lures. Get on them. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe if you like the video. Hit the bell to never miss another one.